And we asked today, is honesty always the best policy? Yes. It's time to go toe to toe. No. Yes. <laughs> I mean, yes. Yes. Very much yes. Because Serena, the kids are watching. That's a good, I was Definitely. thinking that as I was reading. Okay, so it says here, uh, Americans tell about 11 lies per week. Oh. And I say, <laughs> there's no way that's true. Um, <laughs> even though a recent study from the University of Notre Dame says, telling the truth when you're tempted to lie can actually improve your health. So it's really, re we might be two of the healthiest people I know, yeah. actually. This is I, I think it, it's, just, it's too hard to keep up yeah. with the fibs. Just, you know, I mean, that's my opinion. But we'll get to that next. We have a recent example uh, in the headlines. Kristen Stewart, at first, you may remember, she denied the affair. Then pictures came out and she came clean. She came really, really clean, issuing uh, an extraordinary statement. Uh, admitting to the tryst, the fallout has just been enormous, she lied, then maybe she was almost too honest. Yeah, and then maybe because of the lie, the honesty feels even more jarring, and there's a lot to pick through here. So, we've enlisted the help of two experts. <laughs> Sherrod's an expert at this, this is great. <laughs> All right, the, she is the queen of honesty. Yeah. Thank, thankfully, she is here. She's from Bravo's Tabitha Takes Over, and he, of course, is a comedian who lies up and down. <laughs> Tabitha Coffey and Sherrod Small. <laughs> So you know what, uh, Tabitha? I'll, I'll turn to you because it's your it's your biz. Uh, yeah. Are we too honesty? I mean, are we too honest? Are we is is it always the best policy? I think so. I mean, how can you be too honest if you tell someone what you feel and what's going on? Uh. Uh. I mean, do you ever your show? You can you can come across, you know, it's like Simon too, <laughs> but you really, when you're reviewing these businesses, you're t really tough. Do you ever think about maybe softening the blow a little bit and, and saying, no, you're a pretty good hair cutter even though you think they're horrible? No. Why would you lie? <laughs> but, but you're all laughing, but why would I do that? Because then it's not going to help them. Right. So right. it's not about being mean, it's about saying, you know, this is what you're doing wrong, let me show you a way to do it better or let me help you and then we'll we'll get you to that better place. If you say to someone, oh, you're great, it's fa you look fabulous, it's fabulous, yeah. well, they don't learn anything from it. You don't become a better person. What about if you're a parent talking to your child? Thank you. Child you can't tell your kid, hey, I'm trying to be honest with you, there's no Santa Claus. <laughs> Santa Claus. Exactly. That's right. He That's lived. what my mother told me, and I still believe it. Yeah, he I lives wait. in the Bronx. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, but what if your child? What if your child uh, tries a sport and it's not his forte? Uh, asks you, right. how, "Mommy, how did I do?" Well, I think, you, but look, I'm not a parent, so you probably disagree with me, and that's fine. But my mother always was honest with me. So if it was something that I was doing and I wasn't great at it or I didn't really like it, she'd sit down and have the conversation. Well, how do you feel about it? Do you enjoy doing it? Right. Maybe we can shoot you. Maybe we can do this. Or half the time I'd go, you know what? I don't like it. Yeah. I'm doing it because you wanted me to do it, or I'm doing it because Betty Sue does it, or whatever. But I don't want to like hurt and then the you kid. Yeah. You don't want to break the kid's heart, though, if they really stink at basketball. You'd be like, look at little Michael Jordan. <laughs> okay, yeah, but, but That's what, my baby. Yeah, but what's bad at giving a gold star just because, oh, my God, you smiled. You're so cute. Here's a gold but star. But the world, the world will knock him down enough. Once he got out there in the world and coaches send him home without, without putting him on the team, he'll realize that he's not good. But I don't got to tell him that. Yeah, but no one's honest anymore. So everyone gives a gold star for everything. So it's like, oh, my God, you woke up in the morning and ate a sandwich. Oh, you're precious. Here's a gold star. <laughs> you came to work today. Oh my God, you're so fantastic. He's a gold star. But we're not the honest generation. We're not the generation about honesty. We got social media. We lie all day on there. <laughs> this is what we do. This is who we are. Twitter lies. You Facebook clearly, lies. You clearly don't my read space, my tweets all then. lies. <laughs> I'll give you that one. Uh, I, first of all, I love that you're now being cast as like the good one. I, I love the good one. She was on the other foot. Good cop, bad cop. I also think, you know, we, in our business, you know, we hear about asking tough questions. And I always sort of try to amend that. I, I don't see a question that I'm asking is tough. I, it's my job. I'm there to ask questions. It, they may experience the, you know, the question as being tough to mm -hmm. answer, but it's not a tough question But you to know ask. who had a good technique on that? Barbara Walters. She won't say anything evil herself. She'll be like this. What do you say to people saying you're a jerk? <laughs> people saying it, not me. 
<laughs> I'm a journalist. <laughs> She's do a pro. You, do, what, when is it okay to lie? When is it okay to lie? I would say first dates. <laughs> <laughs> Dates and court. <laughs> Very good advice. <laughs> is it when, when is it okay to lie? Um, it's okay to never lie. Oh. I like honesty. I'm sorry. I come it. on. I, I like it. honesty. Ever. I love it. Like if your mother want to come visit you, you somewhere and you, you say I'm busy You don't want to hurt people's switch. feelings. So it's not about saying, do I look fat in this? Yes. You look <laughs> like an elephant. It's not about that. It's about saying, how do you feel about it? Do you like it? I've seen you. I've seen so you in better dresses. Yeah, uh, you know and what? that's and that's okay as well because you don't want to hurt people's feelings. But do you want to lie to people? No. All right. Well, I'm, I'm being very honest when I tell you both this was the best segment we've ever had on the show. <laughs>